It is the nurses that are the mainstay of the primary health care system. And the nurses, they are the ones who are employed. They are the ones who do most of the work. We simply uh, have to rely on them. And then we also have the traditional birth attendants. And, you know, the traditional birth attendants are people who, you know, the traditional midwives, but they are now, they are trained, they are now being trained, given, you know, equipped and helped to be more, you know, productive, more hygienic and all that. They, they constitute a large proportion of the workforce at the primary health care uh, level. We have a lot of difficulty with training of medical personnel and being able to, you know, uh, have the number of medical personnel that, 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 that we require. And that is across the country, but more pronounced in the northern part, uh, more pronounced in the northern part of the country. But this is, a, this is something that a great deal of time and attention is being spent on. I know that several states, uh, because again, you know, as you know, healthcare is also a state issue. Several states are working on it. Some are not as good, or as, uh, are not working as hard as others, but some are really doing a lot of work in that area. I know that quite a bit of work is being done. Quiet Bomb, for example, I know is doing a lot. And Ambra is doing uh, quite a bit of work. Uh, I know that uh, Zamfara State recently, you know, uh, started doing a lot of work in medical care as well, especially training of uh, nurses and also uh, hiring of doctors from, from everywhere.